Welcome back, Vlog. Padres playing wild card game. We're at Dukes. Yeah. Friday. Friday night. Big weekend. Mid October. Of us. So thought we'd uh, no, film beginning it. of October. Haven't filmed in a hot minute, but Most, we've got one, one of the best burgers. We've got in a lot La Mesa. of fun stuff going on, and we're trying a new burger joint because I thought burgers sounded good. And we're starving. Got off work early today, so we're just gonna check it out. As per usual, ordered more than we'll be able to eat. It's Saturday. We're a bit bummed because OU, OU sucks. Our QB sucks. Our defense is destroyed. our defense is typical, which is garbage. Um, mm -hmm. So we're at the mall, gonna get a new phone for Eli because yeah. I got a new one. If you guys remember, like two months, three months ago. Yep. Um, and we have other plans today. So the day's looking up. I've just gotta not let college football affect my day so much yeah oh you football is not my personality anymore i told delaney before the season started even like i know i'm gonna like dwindle down from being like a diehard oh you fan i mean i'm still a diehard but like it's not he's my never been anymore. as into it as i am ever even in college no i i just control my emotions and i understand the game better like if you miss it if they miss he a tackle care. he doesn't care you no know, if they miss a tackle you freak out which i'm like that's, that's expected from our defense like it's just expectations Reality Anyways. meets my expectations with OU football. Anywho, we're at the mall. And I'm going to get a boba, and that's going to make me happy. So, let's right. go. Okay, well, we went to the Apple store, and they didn't have the phone that he wanted. Because I guess supposedly once a new phone comes out, they basically don't keep stock of the older versions, even though... The Pro. The Pro version. Right. Which, I like, wanted now the, that the Pro I want the 13 well Pro, the Pro, but they only sell the 14 Pro in store because but we've heard bad things about the 14 well there's just everyone knows the camera's slightly better and then there's the the crash emergency alert so who cares save 500 bucks and and get uh the model that came out a year ago so now we're at tj maxx no home goods it's a, it's a combo store i'm wearing birkenstocks and they're destroying the top of my foot anyways hopefully we can find a good home steal in here but doubtful. I've been on a bad luck streak of buying things, which Eli would call a good luck streak for him. But maybe I'll find something. We are on Convoy, which is famous Asian district in San Diego. It's also the close to in Shanghai Saloon. Pre fight dinner. Yeah, we haven't told them about our fight yet. Oh. They don't even know that we box. Yeah, no, we don't. The first course at the Dumpling Inn is dumplings. dumplings. We got boiled because we didn't know. But I wanted the little circly thing, the steamed ones. I'm gonna try some of this. How is it? What is that sauce? I thought it'd be like sweet chili, but it's just straight chili. Do you recommend or no? Try it. Um, deluxe fried rice with steak, chicken, and shrimp. Cumplings were good. One of mine took a tumble and got sauce all over my shorts. So Always. White shorts too, because Delaney made me dress up. We've got the orange chicken, which is very orange. Looks orangey. Not better than Panda Express, but really. Up there. Sesame chicken's my favorite if they didn't have it. Ew, and soy sauce? Okay, vlog. I have to update you guys. <clears throat> what we're about to go to tonight is a Muay Thai It's an MMA bite. mash. The octagon. MMA mash. So... Bad to the bone. <laughs> if you guys... I, you don't know because we've been... We haven't vlogged really since I started working that much. Um, you said go through two lights? Yeah, and then take a right. Two but lights, then a right. We started to, we joined a boxing club. It's called the Boxing Club, and they do like Muay Thai, sparring, boxing, MMA, like just uh, things like that. 
and one of our boxing instructors is a Muay Thai fighter and he was having a fight coming up and he was selling tickets so we bought them and it's tonight and we're on our way there right now the Slim Reaper Look yeah, him up. Slim Reaper. If you don't know who he is, you're behind. Um, so we've, I've never been to something like this before, so it should be interesting. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm wondering if I'm going to be like scared, like peeking through to make sure that the people are okay, or if I'm going to be like into it, like knock them out. Don't what do you be, think? Don't be the former. Be the latter. Be the knock them out type? Yeah. So, I think there's like eight fights. And he's the seventh. So. He's the seventh, so we'll be here a while. Starts at six and it's five forty. Here's our tickets. Um, yeah. Hopefully we don't have to stand the whole time. That's the only thing that I'm like. Fifty bucks. Right. So I like. Yeah, I mean they weren't like just some yeah. ten buck tickets. Like fifty bucks. So we Each. better. Yeah, we better get some out of it. <laughs> Maybe some encouragement. Um. So yeah, dinner was okay. I didn't think it was anything special. I thought it was a pretty good spot. It had great reviews. It was okay. Um, definitely better than the Oklahoma City Asian place that was amped up. If you know, you know. Yeah, the China, Grand China. Yeah. And Kevin and Medina. That place is yes, awful. that place is so bad. Um, I also got my hair done since I've seen you guys last. Go, so I'm buddy. Blonde, that's why. Drive, you idiot. And I've got to give him directions, so i got to go. So John won. You couldn't tell. Unanimous decision. Unanimous decision. It's pretty. Cameron had the crowd. Not gonna Cameron lie. Cameron had the like, for sure had the had crowd. Probably three quarters of the crowd, and our crowd wasn't even cheering that loud. But you know. I was saying I was. I felt like I was screaming the loudest for him, and I don't even know him. He's just like our boxing yeah, he, coach. He, he does not know who we are. No, he <laughs> does. If he saw our faces, he'd recognize us, but he doesn't yeah. know our names. We're just students in his class. Yeah. Even though he's like nine but years younger than us. That's pretty badass. It smells like crap over here. Good mm -hmm. grief. We saw a knockout, which we didn't catch on camera, but yeah. it was sick. It happened within 30 seconds. Yeah. And then we saw a technical knockout, and the rest were just judges' decisions. We we stayed for seven fights. Yeah. And There's really... 16 total, which would last a lot. Till freaking midnight. Ugh. <laughs> so bad. Okay, we're headed. Okay, it is now Sunday morning-ish. It's 10. Um, Eli ran 11 miles because he's training for a marathon already this morning, and now he's watching football. 
I went on a walk and now I had some leftover pumpkin puree and so I was like what can I make with this and y'all know we really like the crumble cookies so I looked up a copycat recipe of the pumpkin chocolate chip crumble cookies and I just mixed them up I'll show you guys they look very wet almost like it would be like a loaf like it just doesn't seem like it seems like it's gonna slip apart but I'm just following the instructions. I did exactly what it said. So I'll put those in the oven and then we'll see. Okay, that's how they turned out. I'd say looks like a crumble cookie. It's thick like cake. What do you think? Looks Thanks wise. Good. Ready to try it. Does it look like crumble? Yes. All right. I'm gonna break it in half. Very fluffy and thick. Which is not usually how I like my cookies, but I know you like this. Hmm. Does it taste like crumble? No. Uh, it's a little more cakey. It tastes like a cake, not a cookie. Dang it. Good though. Fail. Okay, it's a little bit later. It's like probably 11.15. And I'm off to go run some errands. Usually Sunday is kind of my day where I do things that I like to do that maybe Eli doesn't like to do. Like go to Target or Home Goods or whatever. Which yesterday we went to Home Goods. Today I'm gonna go to a different area and go to World Market, the Restoration Hardware Outlet, Target. And that's probably it. Um, so I'm headed to do that now, just some time alone, just see what I can find. I really am trying to finish our bedroom. We have like this area above our dresser that just looks horrible and it needs something, but I've, it's been a bust the past month me trying to find something. So that's kind of why I keep home shopping, just in hopes that I'll see something I like, but fingers crossed. Okay, I'm home again and I did find a piece of artwork at Target which Eli does not like but I think it looks good in our room um so I just got home and I've been trying to clean the stainless steel I got like a stainless steel cleaner but honestly not worth I mean it wasn't that expensive but like I feel like any cleaner cleans stainless steel the same and it's still streaky even with the special cleaner so I don't know but I was gonna make this dip super easy everyone likes it Eli loves it um we keep it in our fridge and eat on it with chips all week so I'm gonna show you guys how to make it Okay, this is what it would look like when you're done mixing and then I'll just put the lid on it and let it refrigerate for like two hours before eating it. This would also be really good if you had chives, cut up chives to put in it or green onion. 